space, it's a curiosity for millions, but as we found out, you don't need to go far to experience all of the wonders of the moon. All you have to do is head to the U of M's Bell Museum. What you're seeing right now is the Museum of the Moon. Which is a large artwork installation. It was made by a UK artist named Luke Jerram. And it's on display in the Bell Museum's Horizon Hall. We are celebrating the uh, 50th anniversary of the Apollo moon landing, and so we will be having all kinds of awesome space and astronomy activities in commemoration of that event and future space travel um, all throughout this year. The moon is something that's universal. Everyone around the world sees it. You, you notice it from when you're a little kid on, um, and it's sort of a mystery. Uh, and, and so I think to get to learn more about it, to interact with some of the scientists doing work about it, to connect with university researchers, it's just, it's a really exciting, exciting and inspiring time. So right now we have Museum of the Moon. In July, we'll be celebrating the actual 50th anniversary of the Apollo moon landing on July 20th. Um, and then we'll have events throughout the rest of the year because it was a really important time in, in space travel. Our daily story time it's really fun. I have a four-year-old. I love reading picture books. I love sharing that excitement and passion with some of our youngest visitors. Go big or go home when it comes to the moon. NASA recently announced that they will try to land astronauts on the moon by 2024. And if you want to check out the Museum of the Moon exhibit at the Bell Museum, you have until June 9th.